Thousands of people attended the Bloody Slow Cup annual weekend to commemorate police lost and to raise funds for families of police officers who have died in service. More than just a service, so the service is sad and reflective and, and properly sombre. Um, the game and all the other events around it gives some hope for the future and, and an opportunity to celebrate the lives of those officers that were lost but also have a bit of fun. The, cup, the cups are named after community members who are passed on include the death of four police officers who died in New Zealand town Napier. While New Zealand took home the most medals for the 20th Bloody Slow Cup in Newman this weekend, Australia took home gold for the final match, ending a four-year losing streak with a whopping 29-0 final score. <laughs> Winning coach Michael Faisal said it was a great game of rugby. Uh, these guys that come up, um, that play for us, they're just really passionate. It was the 20 years and uh, we just, I just really wanted to do it for some of the lads that, were, um, uh, that are leaving town. Bloody Slow Cup weekend began to commemorate the death of four police officers responding to a call in the remote community of Kiwikara when the police plane crashed 2.6 kilometres outside of Newman. Yeah, it was a, someone told me the other day that he was a rascal. <laughs> He was a, a bit of a larrikin, um, loved being a copper, always wanted to be a copper. The crash was one of the largest losses of police life in Australia, on par with the recent death in Victoria of four police officers who were hit by an impaired truck driver. Money raised helps families with many different costs. You can see it just, the, the, the first thing we thought about when we joined the Police Academy and we had a talk from Police Legacy um, about the importance of it and it's just lived with us for 30 odd years, um, how, how we send our police officers off, our families send our people in, into battle day in day out and they are in danger at times and some of them don't come home and to have something like Legacy standing behind them supporting the, the scores of children that have been put through school that have been given opportunities that they would not normally have got if they hadn't had Police Legacy. Um, and we're proud to continue to support Legacy, contribute to it, be a part of it, um, and be a part of the culture of WA Police. Now, Camilla Sampson, Ngarda News, Newman.